Could Iran and Russia's secret deal really change the game for global security? Today, we're going to talk about the growing friendship between Iran and Russia and how they're teaming up despite pressure from the West. What could this partnership mean for the Middle East and the world? By the end of this video, you'll see how their alliance might impact international relations in the future. Welcome to the channel. Iran and Russia are teaming up like never before, pushing back against Western pressures and sanctions. What started as a simple relationship has turned into a powerful alliance filled with military and economic cooperation. With Iran stepping up as a key supplier of military resources to Russia, especially during its tough times, this partnership is making waves that could impact global security in a big way. A look back at Iran and Russia's history together. Let's take a quick trip down memory lane. Iran and Russia have always had a bit of a one-sided relationship, where Iran relied heavily on military and technical support from Moscow. But things started to change around 2022, as Russia found itself more isolated from the West due to its actions in Ukraine and other conflicts, Iran decided to take a more prominent role. This wasn't just about helping out. It was a smart move for Iran to boost its own standing in the international scene. Why did this happen? Well, Russia was in urgent need of military supplies as it got tangled up in the Ukraine conflict. With Western nations turning their backs, Russia started looking for friends who could provide both military gear and economic backing. That's where Iran stepped in, supplying military drones and weapons, flipping the script on their historical roles, working together on military stuff. Now let's dive into the nitty gritty of their military cooperation, which has reached new heights. Iran has become a crucial player, supplying military drones and other weapons, showing off its capabilities on the global stage. Reports say Iran has ramped up its support to Russia, sending over thousands of Shahad combat drones and even setting up a drone production facility in Russia. Pretty impressive, right? In September, Iran cranked up its support even more by delivering short-range ballistic missiles to Russia. This move really highlights how close the military ties between these two nations have become. But it's not just a one-way street. Iran is also checking out advanced Russian military tech, like the S-400 surface-to-air missile systems, electronic warfare gear, and fighter jets. All of this is part of Iran's grand plan to beef up its defense and attack capabilities in the region. On top of that, Iran is serious about modernizing its air force. They recently snagged some Russian Su-35 fighter jets, with the deputy defense minister confirming the deal in late 2023. While we don't have all the details on how many jets are involved or when they'll arrive, this acquisition is a big deal for Iran, as it looks to upgrade its aging fleet and get ready for any challenges ahead. Business and trade connection. So let's talk about the money side of things. With Western sanctions hitting both Iran and Russia hard, these two countries are turning to each other for economic support. Their partnership goes beyond just military help. It's all about significant economic cooperation aimed at dodging those pesky sanctions. Check this out. The trade volume between Iran and Russia has really taken off, jumping from about $1.5 billion in 2020 to around $4 billion by 2023. That's a huge leap. This growth is thanks to better financial and banking ties, with both nations working to ditch the dollar and euro in favor of their own currencies for trade. Now, just in the first quarter of 2024, trade shot up by an impressive 48% compared to the same time last year. Russian exports to Iran soared by 77%, while imports from Iran to Russia skyrocketed by 133%. This trend shows that their economic relationship is getting stronger, driven by shared interests and a united front against international sanctions. Iran's impact in the region. Let's talk about Iran's influence in the region. Its role in the Syrian civil war has made it a key ally of the Syrian government, strengthening its military ties with Russia. Since the conflict started in 2011, both countries have supported Bashar al-Assad's regime, helping keep it in power. The partnership between Iran and Russia has been highlighted through big military exercises, including joint naval operations with China. In January 2021, the three nations held their third joint naval exercise in the northern Indian Ocean and the Sea of Oman, showing their growing military teamwork. This collaboration is beneficial for both, Russia gets military support, while Iran gains leverage and technology upgrades. A significant moment for Iran was when the ban on the S-300 missile system was lifted in 2015, 
after the Joint Comprehensive Plan of Action, JCPOA, was signed. The delivery was completed in November 2016 and was part of a larger $10 billion arms deal that included helicopters, planes, and artillery systems. This really strengthened the military relationship between Iran and Russia, Iran joining BRICS. Jumping to 2024, Iran joining the BRICS group was a big diplomatic win. This move helps Iran reduce its isolation and tackle challenges from U.S. sanctions. Being part of BRICS, which includes Russia, is set to improve Iran's standing in global economic talks and open up more chances for cooperation with other emerging economies. The importance of this membership was clear during a regional conference in Turkmenistan, where the Iranian president met with President Vladimir Putin. They discussed rising tensions with Israel and Iran's allied groups. This conversation could lead to a strategic partnership agreement, showing how important their collaboration is. Diplomatic talks and meetings. Let's talk about the recent talks between Iranian and Russian leaders. These meetings have been super important for their partnership. Iranian President Masoud Petseshk and President Putin discussed the rising tensions with Israel. Petseshk criticized Israel's military actions in Lebanon and urged them to stop harming civilians, pointing out that Western nations support Israel. Both leaders condemned Israel for targeting civilian areas in Lebanon and Gaza, showing they're on the same side against outside threats. Petseshk is hopeful that they can finalize a strategic partnership agreement at the upcoming BRICS summit in Russia, which shows how aligned their interests are getting. How the world is responding. Now let's see how the world is reacting to this. The growing ties between Iran and Russia have raised alarms in the US and Europe. The US sees this partnership, especially in military tech, as a big threat to its interests in the Middle East and around the globe. They worry that this alliance boosts Iran's military strength and supports Russia's actions in Ukraine, which could lead to instability. European countries share these worries. They're concerned about the security challenges that come with the deepening ties between Russia and Iran. The military cooperation, like sharing drones and missiles, raises red flags about potential threats to Europe. In response, European nations are being advised to step up their intelligence efforts, engage in diplomatic talks, and think about economic sanctions to limit Iran's military capabilities. Turkey's part in the mix. Turkey's role in the Iran-Russia relationship is quite interesting. It acts as a strategic partner while also trying to balance its ties with NATO. Turkey's location and security issues drive its involvement with both countries, especially regarding the Syrian conflict. Through the Astana process, Turkey has been working closely with Russia and Iran to deal with the Syrian situation. They aim to reduce violence and find political solutions, showing Turkey's role as a mediator in the region. Economically, Turkey is a key player for Russian oil and gas, which are essential for its energy needs. Even with Western sanctions on Russia, Turkey has kept trading, including a threefold increase in re-exporting oil products in 2023. This relationship helps Turkey act as a bridge between Russia and the global market, avoiding some of the restrictions from Western sanctions. Turkey's military purchases from Russia, like the S-400 missile defense system, show it's willing to engage with Moscow, even if it causes some tension with NATO. This has led to issues with the US and other NATO members, highlighting Turkey's desire to diversify its military partnerships, what the future might hold. Looking ahead, the ongoing military and economic ties between Iran and Russia create a complex challenge for global security. As they strengthen their relationship, there's potential for either more stability or increased conflict in the region. The roles of Iran, Russia, and Turkey in this changing geopolitical landscape will continue to shape power dynamics in the Middle East and beyond. The web of alliances forming among these nations shows how complicated modern geopolitics can be. Traditional alliances are being tested, and new partnerships are emerging as global realities shift. The future of this relationship will likely have significant effects on international relations, regional stability, and the balance of power in the Middle East. How do you think Iran and Russia's partnership will affect global security in the future? Share your thoughts in the comments. And that's it for today. Hit the like button and subscribe. Stay tuned for more and catch you at the next one.